Hello there. Got a couple of great metal detecting finds to show you here. Uh, the first one was found by Terry from the Bladen Club. It was on a dig I was at yesterday uh, and I was privileged to see this coin in person. Uh, it's a Roman gold solidus coin. Pretty rare, you don't get much Roman gold. Uh, I'll apologise for the wind sound. It was very windy up there, but really you don't need to hear the audio, just look at the coin. Ah. It's amazing, I can't believe it's so clean. That's amazing. <laughs> oh yes! It's a beauty, an absolute beauty. The same lad found an excellent hammered penny as well from I think it was Henry III or Henry II. That was a beautiful coin so he had the two best finds of the day. Lucky bugger. Upon getting home I phoned my mate who was detecting up in North Northumberland on a new farm and he topped that believe it or not. Well at least I think it's topped it. It's a beautiful gold medieval ring with inscriptions on. It's a real museum piece, absolutely beautiful. So check this out. We're in Northumberland searching a field which is very near a Northumberland stronghold, and uh, something magical's just happened. Look at this. It's a medieval gold posy ring. But well, Jason's just discovered it. And the only person I can think of that could have owned such an item is the person who lived in that stronghold, which is not too far from where we are. It has a medieval script around the outside. And what looks like flowers or corn, possibly corn ears. On the outside, so we'll be handing that in to the, see the farmer, and hand that in as treasure. Bloody amazing! It's almost as good, if not better, than the one off Lord of the Rings. An absolute belter. And that was actually found by Jason. Uh, so congratulations Jason, that's an absolutely beautiful find. I wish I'd found something like that. So that's a quick report on two excellent finds locally. What did I find? I was out nearly all day and I found bugger all. But that's the beauty of detecting. Maybe next time. Thanks for watching.